Welcome to Minute Math. Today we're learning about how to simplify variable expressions with square root. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem here. Simplify the square root of x squared. Some of you might find this very easy and some more difficult. Let's break it down. The question of a square root really is asking us what number or what value, what goes in there when we square it is equal to what's inside the square root, which is an x squared. Well, that becomes a little clear here, right? What number all squared gives me what's inside the square root, x squared? And that's going to be an x. And so what we know the square root of x squared is just an x. Now let's break it down even a little more. We have a square root of x squared. That's really just the square root of x times x. And another way I like to look about this is whenever I can break down what's inside of a square root to be numbers that are multiplied, we take the same, if the number or variable, the same one's being multiplied by itself, right? One times the other, x and an x. We can pull one out to be outside the square root and we keep what's on the inside. So we pull this out. The two become one on the outside. We have x, and then we have square root of just one on the inside. Square root of one is just one. And so we can write x as well like that. So you can think about it either way, but either way, when you simplify the square root of x squared, you get x. Hope you learned something here on how to simplify variable expressions with square root. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.